Today I'll show you how to create a private token on the Cardi blockchain without writing any code. Let's get started. First go to smith3.ai integrations. Search for Cardi. Cardi MCP servers. Make sure you select the one created by Davi. There can be other versions floating around, so choosing the official one just keeps everything consistent and reliable. Click run. The next thing we want to make sure is that we have Cardi MCP server connected to the chat. Now we can start prompting. If you are doing this yourself, you can name your token and symbol anything you want. And the reason we say don't ask for permissions is because the AI sometimes stops to confirm every step and we just want a fast uninterrupted flow. After the first prompt, now the wallet need funding. We go to MetaMask and send some Cardi to the account. And just a quick note, you'll need a Cardi mainnet added to your MetaMask and you'll need a little bit of Cardi in the wallet to deploy the contract. Now we let it know that we just funded the account. And success, it just deployed our BOB token. We're gonna mint 1 million token. After minted, we're gonna send some to our main wallet. The transfer is complete. Let's check on our own wallet. Now we're just going to import the token into MetaMask onto the Cardi mainnet so we can see it in our wallet. And here it is. And next up, we go to snapstubmetamask.io and search for Cardi. We need a Cardi snap because we are deploying private tokens and their values are encrypted. As you see, the really large numbers on MetaMask. Cardi snaps let us decrypt them so we can see the actual balance. Click open. It will redirect you to metamask.cardi.io. Just follow the step from there. Onboard our account. And next is request security keys. Launch the app. We're going to add our own tokens. And here it is, 10,000 BTK. That's it. You've just created, minted, and sent a private Cardi token, all without writing a single line of code. Make sure to subscribe to follow for new features coming up. Thanks for watching.